Hello everyone, my name is Luis and I'm the CEO of Optimum Works, your premier handrail manufacturer. And today we're at a client's house in Los Angeles and I'm gonna show you how to install a handrail. All right everybody, so I'm gonna show you what tools you're gonna to need in order to install the handrail. So here we have a four foot box level, an electric drill, chalk line, stud finder, tape measure, and a pencil or marker. All right everyone, so I'm gonna show you what exactly your order will come with. So here we have the handrail itself, the brackets, the self-tapping screws, wood screws or wood bolts, and the touch of paint. All right, so we're gonna start off by marking up our level at a 36 inch height. Clip the tape at the bottom, mark the height. All right, here, so we're gonna put the level plumb and mark up our height with a pencil. And we're gonna do this at the first step and the top step. All right, so handrails are typically installed 34 to 38 inches above the ground. However, we take this measurement from the corner of the step right here. And here we are at, at 36 inches. Alrighty, so depending on the product that you get, uh, we're gonna need to measure the height of the material. So here we have a two by one tube and we have a one inch height. Uh, so we're gonna go ahead and mark the one inch height in angle. So we see where the bottom of the handrail hits. All right, so you place your bracket one inch under the red line or whatever height the material is. Then you mark your hole with a pencil. Once you have your hole marked, uh, we're gonna do pre drill a pilot hole. Now we're gonna go ahead and bolt down the bracket. All right, so leave it tight enough so that it could still swivel. Alrighty, so once uh, you have two brackets on the wall, we're gonna mount the handrail and then use the self-tapping screws to secure it into place. Alrighty, so here, uh, we're gonna mount our handrail in the position that we want it to be placed in permanently. Make sure the brackets are down. And then from here, hold the, hold the handrail real quick. So we're gonna hold the handrail into place. You're gonna need somebody to help you on this part. And then we're gonna get our drill, self-tapping screws. Then we're gonna aim the hole here at the center, put some pressure and fasten. If you're not able to apply a lot of pressure when applying the self-tapping screws in order to fasten the handrail to the bracket, we're gonna use a drill bit in order to do a pilot hole to make it a lot easier. All right, so here, we're just gonna make a hole at the bottom right here. And this uh, drill bit is gonna be an eighth of an inch. Once the pilot hole is made, I'm gonna get the self-tapping screw and it's gonna guide the self-tapping screw into the handrail. Alrighty, so here we have two brackets placed onto the handrail for support. However, if you have a longer piece, then just make sure to divide a bracket between the, the spacing equally. All right, so a common problem when installing these handrails inside is that you can't locate the wood studs. So here I'm gonna show you how to use wall anchors when you can't find the wood studs. All right, so right here. All right, so once you have the uh, hole marked for the drywall anchor, uh, you're gonna basically need to use a larger drill bit that this anchor could fit into and go through the wall. Uh, so here I have a half inch. 
a drill bit and we're gonna make the hole into the wall. So once the hole is made, you put the drywall anchor through the bracket and then you fold it So once you have the anchor through there, we tighten it. All right, everybody, as you can see, the handrail is up and it is very sturdy. And I really hope that this video helps during the process of installation. Thank you. All right, everybody, thank you for checking out our video and make sure to check us out on Etsy as Optimum Works. And also check us out on my own website, which is optimumhandrails.com. And also check us out on Instagram, which is Optimum Works Handrail. Thank you.